Vicky Bendel from CFAS uh, work mainly on shark bycatch and discard, looking at their behaviour but also looking at their survival after discard as well. So the Shark by Watch project is very much a bottom-up approach, engaging directly with fishermen to get a good understanding of their own bycatch and discard issues, looking specifically at elasmobranchs. Today we're here to actually dissect two dead bicorp pool beagle sharks. They were landed under a dispensation, scientific dispensation, for furthering research basically to create better understanding and awareness for pool beagle research as a whole. We came to get involved in working with scientists because traditionally we've been sort of in opposing camps and that wasn't really getting anywhere. We're saying there's lots of sharks um, and we understand them. Scientists are saying something different. So we thought that um, getting involved in a more collaborative project so that both fishermen and scientists can understand the fisheries, the fish uh, and the fishermen if you like, um, would hopefully yield some benefits in terms of understanding the stocks, where they go, why they're in certain places but perhaps from a fishing perspective, more importantly, about how we can manage them sensibly. It's important to work with the industry, it's important to work with the research community and policymakers because that's how we can actually deliver pragmatic, effective conservation. So you can prohibit the landings of a species, you can remove them from sale, but that actually won't prevent them from being caught. And so it's essential that we work directly with the fishing industry, either on bycatch mitigation and avoidance measures or on improved codes of conduct and handling to ensure that those animals that are caught can be returned with the highest possible chance of survival trying to get a whole range of people that are coming at this from different angles to actually see the benefits of working directly with fishermen, what we can get out of it that historically most scientists haven't been able to do before. So it's trying to use that bottom-up approach to actually bring the fishermen on board, actually get them engaged with what we're trying to achieve for their own goals and for their own fisheries. We've seen um, quite quite good progress in an understanding of some of the practical implications for fishers about why we do catch some dead, why some can go back alive and those sort of things. So from a scientific point of view it's been quite a positive experience. We're now having to work directly with um, the inshore fishermen to then get a better understanding of their fisheries and the management of that going forward.